So the other day I got up and, uh, you know, made my way to the sink. Every morning when I get up, I get up around 8 a.m. I usually wash my face first thing in the morning because it, uh, it's a personal thing, but it wakes me up. So I got to the, the mirror and I'm showing the footage now. I, I was getting ready to wash my face and I just noticed these dark bags or eye bags under my eyes. Yeah, and I know it's kind of hard to see in this lighting, but they're still here. So basically I, got, I saw that and then I came up with the idea of, you know, trying to make this video to talk about it and about other stuff. That was two days ago. I have to get up early because I'm in, uh, I do online college. But that afternoon, I, like after I was done finishing school, I was researching online about what causes these eye bags and what you can do to get rid of them and uh, treat them. So, and that's also when I, when I thought of the idea of making a video about this just because, you know, some people could be going through the same thing right now. I know it's really common um, for the eye bags, I think. It's always been a personal issue of mine. All throughout middle school, if I'm remembering correctly, um, I think my friends used to always say like, you have eye bags, I'm like, you have eye bags, so yeah, I think it's always been a little issue of mine, so I've done my research and then I took notes on about some of the causes of eye bags and the solutions to eye bags, so what you can do to prevent that. I'm also making this video for myself too to look back on, so like at any time like the eye bags come back, and uh, probably like after this video, like the next uh, the next morning after this video is uploaded, I'm going to be doing some of these things because I really want to try to like get rid of these because they were, I don't know, they, I know they have a negative reputation, so I'm trying to like, you know, let's go to get into it. It's so, like the first cause of eye bags that I wrote down was lack of sleep, which goes up without saying, you know, because like, you know, that's the number one cause, but it says where I wrote down oxygen levels and eyes decrease. Uh, when you don't get enough sleep, it causes blood vessels to dilate in the eye. And like what this can do is, you know, you can make those dark circles in your eyes form or under your eyes because of the lack of oxygen. And then it makes these, yeah, it makes the dark circles form. So yeah, that's, not, that's the first cause. The second thing I wrote down for the causes was uh, allergies. Allergies make your immune system go crazy, even if it's like, you know how allergies work, like your immune system attacks. Body, even if they're not harmful, um, so yeah, and then it also causes congestion and inflammation in the face, which will, which will make your eyes puffy. I, I relate to this a lot because I have seasonal allergies, so that means like every single time the season the seasons change, I get, um, you know, I always get I always get a puffy face because I'm outside. If I'm outside in the new season, like my body takes that as a foreign substance, so. I get like really a puffy face and I usually get like runny nose and like you know you know the allergy symptoms like the all that they're just odds real but like yeah I, I get all that stuff and this I always get these eye bags and then they put this the puffy face every single time the season change like literally every single time and my family and friends are just like oh you're flirt you're flared up again I was like yeah I, I really I know like it's like every time but yeah allergies of course substances entering the body usually uh pollen and stuff like that and in the winter there's winter allergens but i can't think of them more right now but yeah when you breathe these substances in when you're outside it uh causes your face to clear up and then especially under the eyes which is number two so the third cause that i have is eating too much salt Sodium can make you retain water. The water causes puffiness in the face and other parts of your body, and this is true too. Um, if you eat a lot of salt um, or a lot of sodium, like your body will just puff up. Basically, strips your body of water, and um, sodium will make yeah. Basically, the sodium will make you puff up in response to the, the water being the pride of. I don't eat a lot of sodium, but like what I do, I'm like mindful of that, so I'm just, um, yeah. So the 
Hurts cause that I put now is get, you know, get us sleep, and I'm, I can see why this is, like, a problem for me, because I usually, like, guys are probably like me, like, I, 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 like, I, I can spend an hour or two at night just scrolling on my phone, um, and then this is bad because the blue light can trick your brain into thinking it's daytime. Uh, which makes it harder to fall asleep when you put your phone down, but basically, yeah, I scroll on my phone a lot at, at night, and I think it helps, I mean, it, it actually makes it harder for me to fall asleep, uh, because, like, it, it usually takes me an hour to fall asleep, um, when I, when I do that, so, of course, getting enough sleep will get, will help you with those eye bags, and, um, yeah. The second thing I have is, you know, taking those allergy meds, if you, if you really need the, the take, you know, like your allergies medication, like I, I, I don't see a problem with it. Um, I know some people say, you know, no, don't take those allergy meds, you don't really need it. Um, I don't see the argument in that, you do need it. And uh, it, it'll really help you because it'll try to block that uh, response, that uh, the immune system response um, through when the, like the, for, the pollen and everything enters their body. It helps control that and it can help you it can help you draw the fluid away from your face which will help you with the uh, puffy eyes and the eye bags in your face so the last thing i've uh, written down but i'm gonna have a, a bonus one because i just thought of something but i said use two pillows at night elevating helps prevent allergy fluid from sitting in your eyelids where it will uh, you know, put weight on and cause those holes in your eyelids. Uh, it can create puffiness in your eyes, I, I said that too. You can also do is, you see my bed right here? Uh, you can put, I don't know, you can still see me right? But I, you can put bricks like on your bed post, which will elevate your, your body and make that uh, allergy fluid um, like drain down to your lower body. Um, you don't want to use two pillows, which will have the same effect, but that can get uncomfortable for some people, so I totally get that. Um, the bonus that I was uh, trying to talk about is, uh, you know, just stay hydrated, like, get your two and take in every day, um, and try to stay, like, away, you know, as possible from uh, alcohol and caffeine, because those will both um, dehydrate you, um, but if you're, you know, addicted to those, you can't really do anything about that, so, yeah, caffeine I can kind of see though, because it's a stimulant, but at the same time it's a durotic, which would make you pee and, you know, just get a, make your body get rid of those, uh, the fluid that you already had in you, but, Caffeine and skincare products um, are actually good because it stimulates your skin or hydrates your skin. So you can you can take what you want of that. So if you guys have been following my channel, I did a review on this, which is an energizer for your skin. This will make your skin look hydrated. This is why I usually always use because it you know kind of hides that those bags a little bit. But I can't use that right now because I'm on a different thing. Uh, this is a um, something that my new stylist uh, recommended me because she also does cosmetology and uh, she said that I have a little bit of acne going on right now so this will help with that um, but also just it's been it's been slowly but surely trying to, it's been slowly but surely helping my eye bags too so yeah this is a get get a good product that will make your face look really good uh, hydrated and good so that will be the last one sorry about that but yeah this was just like a quick video i wanted to throw out there just because i thought it would be useful to you guys and also i'm going to be uh watching this video um so like whenever i get these eye bags again or since i already have them right now i will be looking back at that and using of what i some of what i said for me too so yeah, if you guys want more videos like this, or tips and tricks, or story times, I know that I did a little story time with my uh, middle school, so if you guys want more of that, just leave a like. 
um, subscribe if you're new. We're, we've been sitting at like 5.83k subscribers now for like a minute, so if you want to subscribe, it's up to you. But you don't have to, of course, but until the next video, guys, see you. Bye.